Welcome to Crazy Town's 10 Minutes or Less. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT. Dine. I'm IT Explosive One. Starting timer. <laughs> Did you do it? I didn't. Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's done now. It's Boom. started. Considered done. TNT. What up? Bro code. I like this topic already. So, what are we getting into here? I mean, take it for what you will. Like, what, do you do you think it's a valid, real thing? Do you do you uh, do you participate? What's your favorite part of? I mean, tell when I say bro code, what's the first thing that comes to mind to you? When I hear bro code, I think the first thing is that essentially you have to lie for your bro when he's doing something that may be, um may be a little suspect in a relationship that he's currently in. Okay, so it's nefarious to you. Uh, okay, look, yeah, I'm going to have to say it's that first thing that runs from my mind when I hear bro code is if I'm out with a dude who's in a relationship and he's trying to hit on another girl, I'm going to be that So it's dude. covering for your bro. Yes, that is the first. Okay. And that, it sounds so toxic when you but put it like that. But it's not all that, though. I mean, there's bro code like, hey, what, what other I'm going to go, I'm going to, I'm going to take the attention of the girl you're not interested in, even okay. though I'm not interested in her. So you can talk to the girl you are interested oh, in. Oh, that's the fall on the grenade. Take, yeah, take one for mean, the team. Not, it doesn't even necessarily have to be a girl that you're, I mean, like, it's just, you're like, hey, that, I think that girl's kind of cute. I'm going to go talk to her, but she's yeah. with her friend and she'll cock block you if not. So you're like, hey, I'll go with you, man. Let's just go. So. Let's, yeah, that's taking one for the team. Yeah, that's and that's a part of broke, and that's that's more of a more uh, chivalrous part of broke. Yeah, but there's dude, there's a lot, man. Like because like it can be like it, you know it's funny. Like you know okay. one day I was uh I was talking to you about how bad my neck was hurt, and, and you were like, man, if if you really need some help, I'll help you out. But I would never come to you and go, hey, bro, can you rub my shoulder? Yeah, but, like, but you yeah. know, like, and that's I think that's part of bro code too. Like that, if like your bro was like, dude, fair. I hate to ask you this, my flipping neck is killing me can you like give me some elbow grease in that or something for a minute just to get a you know or you wouldn't Under ask normal me. circumstances that's a hell no get away right. from me but stop like, it ha ha funny i'll tap you in the sack right but under bro code like if you really need it bro i got you. right but i feel like you wouldn't go to your bro and be like hey can you rub my shoulder real quick? unless it was like yo I'm really struggling here. <laughs> okay, so I hate to get back into the whole female thing, but what is your bro code for you and your friend like the same girl? Like we like them? Or like you see a girl in the club, you and your friend, and you both like her, or you see her at college during your A&P class. What do you do? Um, you both like, oh, dude, I'm going to totally ask her out. He's like, dude, I'm going to ask her out. What's bro code for that for you? I, I honestly have never had that situation come up. I know, but that's why. Main, I, mainly because no women like me. I'm joking. Uh, <laughs> so I'm like, you can just have her because she's going to deny me. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> well. Anyways, but uh, no, I feel like, dude, if, if that situation came up, I would be like, why don't we, I mean, both shoot our shot and whoever she chooses, she chooses. Oh, we're not we're not in freaking high school, dude. It ain't like because like, like if, we, that, if we're at though. the bar and we yeah. see a girl, and she's, I'm like, yo, that girl's hot. I'm like, yeah, she is. And you're like, I think I might go try to get a number. I'm like, yeah, me too. And if she chooses you or chooses me, it doesn't matter anything. Wouldn't, wouldn't that like, oh, my, I felt my pride hurt in, in preemptively. No. Well, I mean, <laughs> but you see, here's the thing. I don't have ego. So like I'd be like, she ain't one one for me. The same I feel if I'm like, hey, you want to go out to go out sometime? And she's like, not really. Or, yeah, sure. Give me your number. And I'm like, okay, okay. I'm going to let you guys in on a little thing that actually happened in this household and what it could have <laughs> potentially turned into. Okay. Oh, yeah. I think I know what you're talking about. Okay. So me and Jonas, we went to a bar with a couple of people from an improv class that we had. And we ended up bringing a young lady home. And she came and hung out. And she had a history of being a little bit more of a free spirit. Can we say that? Can we say she was a free spirit? Is that okay? Sure. She was a free spirit. Um, I had taken her out on, on our balcony and I had spoken with her at nauseum about some of her activity. And we found that we had shared similar pasts. And right, right. It was just like we were, we were, there was a click going on. And Jonas had already established this whole uh, a rapport with her prior to this ha potentially could have turned into something more where on bro code would you have felt about anything that could have transpired and would you have gone even further i have to ask i have to ask where uh well 
I wouldn't have cared either way because I had already made it clear to that girl that whatever happened between us, that's all it was. It wasn't okay. going to be, it wasn't, okay. I was, she wasn't going to be my girlfriend. So like we weren't going to date. Okay. So would you have wanted to go first? Had, I think I had already went first by then. Okay. So, I mean, I'm, okay. I mean, for that well, night, well, at least. Reversed. How would you have felt have been like, oh, you already hooked up with her and now she wants to go yeah, with I me? I would have made you go first. Oh, man, why would you have made me go first? I don't, I have, I have no problem. The with, same, but the, I'm, are you talking about the same night? Up. Like, she yeah, would have been like. I feel like that night, it might have either been A, one after another, or it would have been B, at the same time and uh, these are the questions that i'm asking you is she, how you would have felt yeah, about she, either situation she really ruined that for herself didn't she and she did screw it up for <laughs> herself and you know honestly in hindsight i know it's only because i'm going through a drought but i'm like i probably should have just gone ahead but i didn't and yeah. i feel good about the fact that i didn't but would you okay so when i'm asking you is like in a situation of one after another would you have wanted to go first or at the same Dude, time would like... you have <laughs> would you have been cool with that <laughs> Like, oh, you're talking about bro code in the fact of would you have sex with a woman with your bro? Yeah, am I a good enough bro where you would have been like, yo, dude, let's just get this three. Well, well, here, well, well, here's the thing. Here, here's the here's the thing. It, I guess here <laughs> it, is technically, it is technically a threesome, I guess. Here, here's the thing. I guess it comes down to what's the opportunity? How bad do you want it? And is the opportunity there to be one after another? Or is the only opportunity to do it together? Okay, but in either situation, like, what's, your, if, what's your preference? I, I think guess. if I if she was like, "Hey, we, I'll either do each of you like that specific situation." Any woman, yes. If she was like, "Hey, I'll either do both of you separately, or we could do it together," I would choose separately every time because why not? Okay, okay, okay. So but, that's your preference. That's but cool. That's if she was like, that. "I will only do it if you both do it at the same time," I'd be like. You're enough of a bro that I'd be like, sure, let's do it. Bro, are we going to finger cuffs her? <laughs> I guess. Would you high five me? <laughs> <laughs> Only if you ask nicely. <laughs> no, I want a real answer. I don't want a pro joke pro answer. Probably. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> no, but That's I... That's my boy! Yeah, I mean... <laughs> I mean, oh listen, God. listen, I'm never going to pull my stuff out in front of you, but if it's like, if it's a hot chick and she's like... Only if you two do it together, I'd be like, well, hey, for the first time for everything, friend. Hey, yo, bro code is, is that you don't walk around a house nude, but yo, if the situation is going to, I'm not judging your meat. <laughs> right. I'm not even going to look at your meat. Like, for yeah, real. I may see it in context, but I'm not like, I'm trying not to. <sighs> yeah, dude. I don't know. But, uh, I don't but, know if I'm ready to see your meat, to be honest. No, I don't dude. think I'm I mean, it's, I don't, I don't it's not on my I'm bucket ready. list. <laughs> it's not on your bucket list. <laughs> but, like, but then here's the thing. But it also depends because, like, mm. if it isn't a girl that I'm trying to get with mm. and I'm, like, I don't care if I get with her or not, I could just be, like, no, you can have her, dude. It's fine. Okay. So I, I just have to verify is that you're saying that you would participate in a threesome with me. I guess, yeah. If the, if, it, it's all situational. I mean, How long has it been since I had anything? How attracted to the girl? Do I have an opportunity to get with the girl if you're not involved at a later time? Yes. I mean, there's because you're gonna those... take you're gonna take the alternative if possible. Right. But well, I'll tell you what, dude. If like arise. some if like a supermodel walked in and she was like, "You have one shot. Either both of you with me at the same time, or neither of you ever get to do me ever." I'd have to seriously be like, "Well." I, I wouldn't mind having a shot at that. <laughs> Me and you are definitely going to have to have a sidebar, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like that scene in Weird Science where they go into the shower. Now, you've, you've probably never seen that movie, but they're just... There's somebody at home. Has. Yeah, somebody got that reference. But yeah, dude, But yeah, we're going to have to have a side. We're going to be but, like, hold on, young lady. But I think lady, there's right also there. a female code that's the same as the bro code. Just It's just different things. Oh my god! I couldn't even get into female code. I don't. I don't know if I fully understand it. And I've. I've a lot of it is protective, from what I understand. Yes. Yes, it, yes. It's. It's like you know. It's like you feel unsafe. You can walk up to any woman and be like, "Sherry, oh my god, it's been forever since I've seen you," and give them a big hug. And then they're like, "Who are you trying to get away from?" Or yeah, you know, or, right? or they're in the bathroom together and they're wow. like, "Hey, hey, I need you to come up and pull me away from the person I'm with." And they'll be like, "Hey, I've been looking for you. Come on, let's go." A like a whole different set of priorities, yeah. right? Yeah, well, because like crazy. because and I'll finish this thought. You know, in talking to women about this, they have a lot more fear of like you know they're like as a man, you never are afraid walking through a parking lot I, at night by yourself. No. I have no predators in the wild, as right. far as I'm, exactly because I, I what was it? I said something to a friend of mine. I was like, "Hey, there's this app." That you can like, 
if you're, you hold a button down on the app and if you let it go, it calls a contact and they're like, Oh, I know about that. I've known about that for years. Like I've used I've apps like that. And that. I'm like, what? And they're like, this is the difference between men and women. And I was it like, really is. It really and I was is. like, oh, fair. Anyway, gotta be cognizant of that. That's too. all that we have for today's episode. Jonas. TNT. Go to thecrazydown.com and subscribe. We're out.